Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome back to the Game Skates. Today and only today, we're gonna do something that I don't usually do on the channel, but I thought, hey, you know what? This probably won't take me long and I'm fucking excited for this character, so I thought we will do a little kind of, not analysis, but like a little breakdown of the Ultra Instinct Goku perfect UI mastered god tier, whatever the fuck you want to call this amazing looking character for Dragon Ball Fighters. We're gonna do a, uh, I've already seen the trailer, so this isn't a live reaction. I don't, you know me, bro. I will not bullshit the live reaction, alright? If it's gonna be a live reaction, it's gonna be live, you know what I'm saying? So what we're gonna do is first we're gonna watch the trailer with you guys, just so I can see it again. I only saw it in the morning in bed, tired as shit. Uh, so we're gonna watch it again, then we're gonna go to run it through, see what moves he's got and shit like that, alright? So let's, let's start this fucking trailer, let's get in there. Alright, so let's uh, watch this baby. Bro, he just looks... So this we saw before, right? Now, obviously, it's yeah, you handle Ultra Instinct. I'll show you how I handle Ultra Instinct, bro. I fucking kick ass. So this this we saw in the in the original trailer. Now this from the anime. I let's just watch this for shit, bro. God, he looks so fucking cool, dude. Like he is on my team permanently, permanently, bro. Oh my god. It's just... He does like the fuck. Oh man, okay. Yeah, yeah, I just... Ah! Alright, baby. And there's level 3. I assume he's gonna have 2. I hope he does this shit's fucking crazy. And then... He does the fucking... What's his name? What the fuck's his name from Street Fighter? Akuma. Is that his name, Akuma? I'm pretty sure his name, Akuma. If not, I'm done. So, available May 22nd. So, that's a chair. Now, let us... Okay. Now that we've seen it, alright? Let's kind of run it through, alright? So, let's, let's go back to the beginning here, right? Let's go back to the beginning here. So... Right away, you know, we've we've seen this beginning. we probably seen it a million times because we've seen the first trailer, right? Now... Let's keep going here. So, now he... I think this is the first time we hear him say... Let's see how you handle Ultra Instinct. Again, I'm really excited to see his character interactions. One of my favorite things whenever a new character, like a DLC drops, is seeing what his interactions with the other characters are, right? So, like, what's Krillin gonna say when you fucking match him against Perfect UI Goku? He's just gonna be like, get the fuck away from me. Um, so, I can't wait to see those conversations in there. And we know he has the dramatic finish with Kefla. We saw that in uh, the scans of uh, V-Jump. A few weeks back, so I think uh, that'll be like maybe the launch trailer for him. Uh, so I can't wait to see that shit. So let's say we go right in here. Now a lot of this is reused, so this exact footage we've seen before. Now this is new. So this move is one of the early moves he pulled with Perfect UI, where basically he was like blocking everything around him. Uh, he usually did this in Mastered in in the first UI form. Not perfect UI form, but obviously, this is the perfect UI form, so we're doing that. Now, he does the toss, which is really cool. He does the toss. He does the air. It's now, I think he's going to be a very counter every character. So, you see, obviously, so he does a vanish there. But it does, like, a vanish forward hit. It doesn't do, like, a vanish. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's like, it's hitting him forward. Now, this move, obviously, so he did this in the anime where he shot kind of, it's, like, it's almost like he has controlled Kamehameha's where, like, he's centering them into balls. He did that in the anime, so it's cool to see they're implementing that there. I assume this is a level 1. This looks like a level 1. This is obviously his forward special. Uh, that's his down square, I assume. Down circle, I assume. Um, that's his neutral. He So, he's got the Jiren move. So, the Jiren move here, you see that, yeah, because Jiren has this exact move where you put him in the corner and you hit him a bunch like that. Yeah, that's the Jiren move. So, he's got that. He's got the... What the fuck character does? So he's got... The, he's, I think he follows it up. He follows it up. So he does the Jiren kick and then he pushes you down. This! This exact from the anime. This... So is this all one combo? No, this is a different combo. So this move he does in the anime where basically, you know, he hits him, he gets away from Jiren, and then a ton of blasts in him at once. Look at this. Boom. Very cool detail. He's got like an air push there. He's got obviously this iconic move where he hits him and then he just goes... Brah! Crazy. He's got his counter, obviously. So here it looks, it looks like when you counter, you counter with a Kamehameha. Maybe you can choose to counter and then use a special to use the Kamehameha. And obviously this, this is one of the money shots, bro. This move is when he does that iconic like forward lunge. Yeah, look at that shit. Look at this frame, bro. All I see with this is hype, bro. This is the shit 
we live for, alright? So we get this, boom, smacked right there, bomb, got him, and oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We're not gonna, we're not gonna deny that. Look at this, look at this radiant energy, bro. Look at this radiant energy. Now, I assume this is a reference to the, like, original big power-up he does when he goes all instinct and he's like, ah, and he fucking goes wild. So this, this shot, bro, this is... This is, I would argue, the one of the most iconic perfect Ultra Instinct Goku shots. I've had I had this as like a wallpaper for the longest time where he does the punch to Jiren's face. Obviously, he's gonna be punching a lot more than Jiren's face in this game. Uh, but he's got that in there. So again, looking beautiful as always, the way Arxis does this. So this is clearly his level three, because obviously he goes into and he's doing all these crazy look at this shit. Boom! And then this money shot, bro. Oh my god, first of all, wait, 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 we're not, we're not gonna, first of all, look at this shit, so first of all, he does the punch, it's already insane, then he does kind of the Kefla intro where he's going crazy fast, but he's doing it Ultra Instinct style, boom, and then look at the 3D camera angle, bro, he does the punch, he gets ready, the camera's spinning, and massive Kamehameha, bro, insane, this character, now I'm thinking of, I'm getting the hang of this power, bro, he looks so fucking clean, dude. May 22nd, that's all we got. I don't know if we're gonna get another character reveal soon. I assume whatever Eva was going to be is still a while off, so maybe they'll announce one by, like, July. But, uh, I don't know. So, yeah, May 22nd for Ultra Perfect Ultra Instant Goku. He is looking fucking cool as shit, uh, and I'm just... So excited for this guy. Sorry, my fucking Twitch bar is there. I just left it there. But yeah, so he looks fucking amazing. Let me know what you guys think of him. If you guys are picking it up, I assume you are. If you give a shit about fighters, he is going to be on my team permanently, bro. Permanently. That's it. That's all. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time. Peace. I love you.